Hi folks, I'm Lumpy Gravy and welcome to part 10 of my Thimbleweed Park walkthrough. And this is going to be the last one. I think I'll probably do um, an extra upload because I'm sure there's more than one way to end. And there's, there's a few bonus things as well I want to show you guys. But uh, we need to get into the office. So first things first, let's get back to the mansion. I can't open that. I'll use that. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? It's another part of the game that I was very much stumped on, actually. Um, it's actually quite funny, because... I went out the room to make a brew and I was left in the office and I just couldn't think what to do and then I just saw it flashing at me right behind that painting there but yeah I just didn't notice that okay so we pick up the office key let's get back to the factory the office key okay so we can uh, we need to pick up this hat we need to pick up the glass and the journal we need um, is it quicker to oh. we need to give the floppy disk um, to Dolores. That ransom house. May as, may as well bring him up here anyway. Okay. Um, oh yeah, well, floppy disk was in the bag. And we'll give Thank you. the floppy disk to Dolores. Okay. It's booting up. Use the floppy disk Dolores. on the computer. I feared you would come. Uncle Chuck? Where are you? I have uploaded myself into the Pillow Factory's master computer. Pillowtron? You uploaded yourself to Pillowtron? Not just the Pillowtron, but the Pillowtron 3000 TM. And I am now more intelligent and powerful than anyone in the world. The things I know would blow your mind. This is your mind. <laughs> this is your mind blown. And there is nothing you can do to stop me. The computerized world will bend to my every will. Uncle Chuck, you have lost your mind. No, Dolores, I have gained a mind, a more powerful mind, a mind linked to the fabric of creation. Join me, Dolores, before it's too late. I will not join you, Uncle Chuck. I will find you and stop this insane plan of yours. <laughs> Let the games begin. Okay, um, let me just check this journal. Right, we need the um, cheat book, which, does Ransom have it? Hang on. Um, yep, the hint book. Um, we need to give that Thanks. to Dolores. We got the hint book from ThimbleCon. He exchanged his limited rare edition comment, comic for it. And we need to use... Oh, we need to use this red gel decoder which was on the shelf next to the trophy in Dolores's room okay um, so when entering it says heading east um, we need to head East and then west. I think we need to head east and west, right? Right. I think that's what it's telling me to do. Um. Oh. Password. Where's the password? Look at. 
Um, Uncle Chuck was a strange and complicated person. A brain fart. Right. Try using the computer. We need the password, of course. Oh, wrong button. Let's get out of this. Of course, right, in order to get that password, we need to go back to the mansion. Um, we couldn't do this before because we needed um, to pick up the glass. And where's Reyes Heat? We're gonna need we're gonna need you. Let's just send you there as well. Right. Um, we're gonna need some soot. Great. Now I'm carrying around a handful of black soot. Um oh we need sellotape. Um and Only an agent can get the tape from the post office because we need to get a fingerprint. I think the post office was at the bottom here. No, it wasn't. The bottom of A Street. Go easy on the tape. We're almost out. So we've got the tape, let's go back to the mansion. Um, I'll just give the agent everything, so uh, we need to give him the glass. Happy to help. Oh, I love and carrying stuff. Give him the soot. And if we use Soot, and then use sellotape. We get a fingerprint. Thank you. Give that to Dolores because she's the only one who can go in the mansion. I think. Well, anyway, yeah, pretty sure. something inside um. okay let's get back to the office Notebook. Use red gel decoder. Thought I did that before. Heading east will cause instant death, so we don't want to go east. Head to the west. Look around. There's not much to see. Right. Head west again. So we need to head west twice and look around. Okay, so use the computer. The password was this one. I jotted it down. Okay. Oh. Let's 
So west twice. Look around. Um, go to the light. Head north. So it was go west twice. Look around. Head north. And now I've opened it. I can say that. Yeah. I think that's what I did. So yeah, I went west twice, looked around, headed north, and then You're not doing this without it me. gave me the option I to say them too. words. Please. I think we're locked in here now. Yeah, we're screwed. Fools! You are trapped in the factory with no possible escape. My intellect now spans millions of tubes and is no match for your little brains. This is the last chance to join me before I destroy you all. Shall we take a vote? All in favor of joining Uncle Chuck inside the magical mind of the Pillotron 3000 TM and ruling the world with him say, I. Very well, all in favor of being crushed by robot claws and burned by lasers and remaining pathetic mortals, say aye. 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 Abstain. So be it. Let no one say I don't support a strong democracy and the will of the people. <laughs> you will now all die. Okay, so we need ransom. Hard to we unwrap. need to open the brick. And that's C4. We need to use the C4. Oh, use C4 explosive on this door. And use this candy dispenser. My computer! So Five, four, down. three, two, one. Emergency reboot. Help me! Please! Help me! To push the button to turn that off. Right, Dolores. Um, we need the tinfoil. So let's give Thank the tinfoil to Dolores. Back to Dolores, use the tinfoil with the hat, and then use the hat. So get us past the lasers. You will never get past my searing lasers of doom, Tim. You are doomed! Hold on, hold on, wait a sec. I want to turn down the volume so you can hear my maniacal rant. I just piped the sound in so it feels scarier. Lasers are actually as silent as a baby's bottom. Anyway. You are doomed! You will never get past my searing lasers of death, Tim. You pesky kids will never thwart my plan. You are all doomed against the AI power of Pillowtron 3000, TM and patent pending. Ha! Didn't feel a thing! You just wait for the lasers of doom, Tim. 2.0! Kick that! Kick that! Didn't feel a thing! No fair! Sounds right off. Ha! I filed this. Okay, now at the giant fan, we need to look at this sign. Uh, so the number is 4877. Now, Agent Reyes can't get a signal on her phone in the factory, so the only person who can ring. And. Um, is it 4877? Right, four, eight, seven, seven. This is the fully automated fan service for fan number 37532. Current state of the fan is on. Turning fan off in three, two, one. Current state of the fan is off. 
think I can squeeze doors. past the Especially fan now? Inside here. Overheating won't hurt me. Overheating won't. Okay. Need to switch the fan back on. Because can't touch anything. Uh, so we need a four, eight, seven, seven. This is the fully automated fan service for fan number 37532. Current state of the fan is off. Turning fan on in three, two, one. Current state of the fan is on. Bring it on. I can take the heat. That's can nice. you? Ow! The ladder's too hot to touch. Overheating won't hurt me. Okay, so now I've opened the trap door. Um, Pillotron 3000 PM and I are one powerful beyond your we need comprehension. To use the strange tool in the slot. Back you will Dolores, never defeat nobody else me. Will go in there. Uh, Dolores, you are making a big mistake. What happened to you, Uncle Chuck? I have been uploaded to Pillowtron 3000 TM. Together we are now invincible. You could have joined us, Dolores, but you had to leave me to be a... to be a game designer. You've been corrupted by bad tube technology. I will destroy you, Uncle Chuck. Or what's left of my Uncle Chuck. You will never defeat me, Dolores. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so just need you to push all these tubes. Me, Dolores. Death is all that awaits you now. Dolores, shutting me down will only make me stronger. You should have listened to me. Help me, Dolores. You should have listened. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. Death is all that a- Save me, Dolores. You found all the clues I left. I knew you would come, Dolores. You were too smart not to figure out the puzzles. Save me, Dolores. Dolores, it's me, your Uncle Chuck. I'm glad you came to save me. Save me, Dolores! You tried to kill us. Why should I save you? Because I discovered something you'll want to know about. Pull up a chair, Dolores. This is going to get crazy. <laughs> okay, one, you lock me in here and I can't get a chair, and two, how can it get any crazier than your uncle downloading himself into a tube-based computer? Good point, but it's going to get crazier. It all started when I discovered the Tron tubes held the secret to AI. Uh, aardvark insemination? Yes, aardvark insemination. No, artificial intelligence. I know, Uncle Chuck. I was just trying to lighten the mood. As I made the Tron machines smarter and smarter, they began revealing secrets. Then they invited me to join them inside. Well, it started out as an invitation, but quickly turned into a demand. Let's move on, Uncle Chuck. Okay, this is where it gets really weird. I downloaded this text adventure. Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2. Downloaded? You mean it was pirated? Well, look who's being judgmental. It doesn't matter how I got it. It's their own fault for not having a demo. Okay, now you're just getting preachy. Can I get on with my story? The more I played and modded the game, the more I realized not only was this adventure game a little simulation, but the world we live in is also just a simulation. But worse than a simulation, we are all just characters in a video game. That's crazy. Think about it, Dolores. Who is your mother? Do you even have a mother? Have you ever spoken about her or even thought about her? No. 
No, I haven't. Think, Dolores. Think about all the odd things in this world. Like we go around collecting specks of dust? That's not dust you're collecting. They are pixels, the building blocks of our world. They are put there to prey on the compulsive among those in the upper world. Like the sheriff and the coroner are the same actor? Ah, but I haven't exactly. picked up any pixels Probably in this Probably saves play money for. on voice acting talent and art and animation. I've heard enough. I believe you, Uncle Chuck. Well, I'm glad, Dolores. I knew I could trust you. We have to hurry. The developers know we're onto them and are trying to reboot the game. If they do that, we're caught back in our endless cycle of pointless pretend free will. We need to shut down Pillotron 3000, delete the game, and end our existence. It's the only way we'll truly be free. Delete the world and end our existence? Yes, it's the only way. The developers keep rebooting us back into the same story over and over. They will do anything to keep us from deleting the game. Thimbleweed Park is a cash cow. They can't let it end. But I am shutting down Pillowtron 3000. No, not this Pillowtron 3000. The original Pillowtron 3000. The concept art wireframe Pillowtron 3000. The developers transferred all the code to it when they saw how close I was getting. You must find it and shut it down before they reboot us. Let's do this thing. We've been watching on the big monitor outside. It's mind-blowing. What the f***? It's all fake like my ex-wife. I know none of this is real now, but I still need to clear my father's name. I was so close to getting a big payoff. I can't let this slip away. Before it all ends, I just want one more show. One last chance to live in the f limelight. I've hidden away four inventory items that will fulfill your endings. Take them and you'll be free. Dolores, I saved the best one for you. I can't tell you how to use it. The developers deleted all my dialogue in the hopes of keeping it from you. Your only clue is back in the original Kickstarter video. Everything you need is there. I'm going deeper into the simulation now so they can't find me. Good luck and hurry. I love you and am very proud of you. Even me? Shut up, Ransom. Shut up, Red. Okay, so last time I completed this, I did it with uh, Dolores, so I'll just do what I did last time and maybe I should save the, the game animal first. With the corpse. We don't need to save the game. Oh no! I've already saved the game. This can't be good. The game is glitching. Uncle Chuck was right. This must be the wireframe world. The game's concept level the developers built to test their design. I need to find the wireframe Pillowtron and... Okay. <laughs> Very manic mansion, this. Get to the factory. Yep, work past the quickie pal. I can't reach um, that. Where's the gate? There it is. 
I don't think there's any animation for that. We can probably walk right through. Yeah. That we can. Um... Lasers in 2D. And This looks like the wireframe pillowtron Uncle Chuck described. I just need to push all the tubes in, and the world will be shut down, and will end the madness of no real choice and control over our destiny. Of course, that's what Uncle Chuck says, and there's still a chance he's insane. Never said goodbye to Franklin. Last one. I hope Uncle Chuck knows what he's talking about. I need to get up my nerve. Come on, Dolores. You can do it. Okay. This is it. I'm going to do it. Let's end this. And there you have it. <laughs> Messy world, yay! Managed to complete the game without any picking up any specks of dust, which was very hard actually, even on the second playthrough. Uh, but yeah, that was completing it with uh, Dolores. Um, I'm gonna come back and yeah, definitely just do a few other things that I found out, a few Easter eggs bonus things and the other endings I think but um, and uh, probably come back with my thoughts on the game as well actually because uh, I really enjoyed it so I'll see you in that one but yeah that's the end of the walkthrough hope it was a big help to you guys anything you got stuck with until the next one though see ya